This morning, we have a basketball icon in our midst. Ah, yes. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar is one of the greatest NBA players ever with one of the most unstoppable shots, that legendary skyhook. He is a six-time NBA champion, six-time MVP, 19-time All-Star, and until last week, the all-time NBA scoring leader. We're going to talk about all that. Kareem's also uh, here to raise some awareness about an important topic during this American Heart Month. Uh, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, we are honored, Good sir. Morning. Good morning. Thank you. It's great to be here. Oh, my right. gosh. Well, let's start with the, the No Time to Wait campaign. You're a paid spokesperson. Um, but we're, we're going to spend some time talking about atrial fibrillation because you had a health scare a while back. Oh, I had a health scare. Uh, I was uh, traveling in Europe with my son and um, had, uh, you know, shortness of breath, fatigue. Uh, you know, I, I, I didn't had no energy. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, I was worried about it, but it, it wasn't consistent. Okay. You know, it would come and go. I thought, hey, I, I, I've been in shape all my life. Right. Yeah. You know, this is not going to infect me like that. Yeah. Uh, I get back home. Um, I'm at the Dodger game, and I'm sitting in the sun, and the sun is whipping me, and uh, I don't have the strength to stand up. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. And uh, my breathing w- w- was heavy. They had to help me out to my car. Mm-hmm. While I was going past the trophy case, I, I collapsed against it. Oh, my goodness. It was rough. Mm-hmm. And I-, I didn't know what was going on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was the whole problem. I didn't-, didn't understand what was happening. They took me straight to the hospital, and they told me about how uh, my-, my condition was called atrial fibrillation. Mm-hmm. It-, it affects your heart, and it increases your probability of having a stroke by a factor of five. Wow. Wow. And it can kill you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But if you don't know about it sure. and uh, just let it run on and run on, mm-hmm. you're going you to have, have a bad day. You caught it early. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you What's your message? Now? Yeah. My message is go get checked. Go to the hospital. Uh, uh, Bristol Myers, uh, Pfizer, they have a program. Uh, no time to wait. Mm-hmm. Uh, they're looking to for for people who are waiting. Don't wait. Yeah, mm-hmm. go get checked. Yeah. Absolutely, right. that's an go important message. Checked. Can we talk basketball for a moment? Uh, last week, LeBron James um, broke your NBA scoring record, uh, which you held for more than 38 years. And my heart just lifted. We were wondering if you were going to be there, and then when we all saw you there on the side, we thought it was so special. Take me back. What was that experience like for you? Well, it, it was a special moment for me because uh, when I I set the record, Wilt wasn't there. Mm-hmm. Wilt had something to do, so he. And he <laughs> no, we, we were in Las Vegas, yeah, so you know, right. he, Wilt lives in Los Angeles. He he couldn't make it, but um, it, it was uh, something that uh, you know, it, it was special for everybody yeah. because uh, nobody expected him to to break it. Everybody mm-hmm. tells me it's the two point shot. Right. That's what did it to me. But you know, ro- records are made to be broken. What did you say to him, to LeBron? Oh, I, I just said congratulations. You, you definitely have earned this. Uh, there's, you, there's no two ways about you it. You say congrats on shooting all those threes? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I, I did make one. I, literally. <laughs> a lot of folks don't know that. In your entire career. My entire career, I made one three-point one shot. One three-point shot. Because was, back then, it just wasn't what it is now. And the big man was not supposed to shoot it. You, yeah. you oh. shot this three-point shot, you come and sit down next to the coach and... He tells you about how you're going to lose your job if you keep shooting those three-point shots. Wow. So, uh, you know, it was, uh, it was tricky, wow. but I got through it. <laughs> you're an NBA legend. There's no question about that. But you are also a comedy legend thanks to this scene. Uh-oh. Oh, we got it? Roger Murdoch. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. And, I mean, airplane. <laughs> I to this day, I mean, do people still come up to you and, and to uh, Roger, right? You, you see this, the young man in here? Uh-huh. I met his wife. He's like 45 oh years old now. <laughs> this kid here, I, I met his wife in the airport somewhere. <laughs> oh my That's my goodness. husband, you know? And look at him. He's, he's nine years old, man. That's that is fun. a great scene. It's the best. That's great. Uh, so it's it's been about 35 years now since you're, you won the last championship with the Lakers. What was it about, you know, that whole era of basketball that, you know, people still just are nostalgic about? I think there were a lot of teams that had a lot of guys playing that were very fundamentally sound. Hmm. Uh, look at the Detroit Pistons. Uh, you look at the, the Boston Celtics. Yeah. 
our hated rival. <laughs> uh, you know, the, there were a lot of teams that were coming together, mm -hmm. putting the right uh, players together, and um, it became harder and harder to, to make it to the final. So. We don't have much time, and I've been fortunate in my career to see a lot of championship rings up close. I've never seen a ring like the ring that Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. <laughs> can can we zoom in? Can we? Can I? Can I just? Can I? Can I hold it? Sure. No, can you hold it? Can I just hold it? That's a bold ass. Door's locked, right? Yeah. I just I want to show folks at home. <laughs> Tell folks at home about this ring, Kareem, please. Well, the the Lakers gave me that ring. Uh, oh my God. My, my boss. She's still my boss. Jeannie Buss is so wonderful and generous. And she gave me this ring to show the Lakers appreciation for what I did for the for the franchise. Mm. And the game of basketball. And the game of basketball, Absolutely. of course. Wow. But I always took that for like. granted. Oh, it's yeah. the heaviest ring I've ever felt. <laughs> for, Amazing. An honor. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you, you Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Thank you so much uh, for being here. Nice visiting with you. Okay. Thank you. Yes, sir. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.